After months of preparations, the Russian President Vladimir Putin has launched a major military operation against Ukraine. Loud explosions have been now heard as the Russian assault has begun. These are among the darkest hour for Europe since the end of World War II. The UK is announcing the largest and most severe package of economic sanctions that Russia has ever seen. Assets will be frozen for all major Russian banks. Russian teams are banned from competition. Sponsorships across all sports and divisions are ended as the international sporting community moves to further isolate Russia. In the winter of 2022, the impact of the Ukraine invasion reverberated throughout the globe. In Helsinki, the fallout was felt on the ice, bringing one of its beloved hockey club's season to a halt. Jokerit, the distinguished Finnish franchise, joined most of the world by immediately distancing themselves from Russia, which resulted in the team withdrawing from competition in the Russian-operated Continental Hockey League. For the first time in their rich history, Jokerit would spend an entire season sidelined while they began the process of returning to compete again. Due to the near-global sanctions imposed on Russia, Jokerit's Russian-owned arena in Helsinki was shuttered and the club was required to divest all Russian sponsorship and funding before being approved to resume play in Finland. Essa Lindell, who spent his younger years playing with Jokerit's junior team, was inspired to help bring the club back to life under Finnish ownership. Well, I felt that was the only right thing to do to get away from it and get away from all the situation Russia has with the war. Led by Chairman Miko Sarni, a new ownership group was created involving Jokerit alumni. Alongside ESSA, Carolina Hurricanes forward Tevo Teravainen and retired NHLer O.C. Vaninen joined the initiative to get Jokerit back on the ice under complete Finnish ownership. When we started this, it was crucial for us to, to get the right people involved and ESSA being uh, one of the products of Joker Youth Organization, and, and he's been there all throughout his career before uh, going to the NHL. He was definitely one of the names uh, on top of the list. Team Joker had a new coming, so they asked me if I would be one a part of it, and I was very excited right away to chance to help the team where I Spent many years when I was growing up and the team I cheered when I was younger. After a full season absent from competition, Jokerit was granted a license to play in the Finnish league Mestis in May. Four months later, they returned to the ice in front of their exuberant fan base. I got really pumped up. The fans were there. The hype was big, and I feel the hype is just growing now, seeing Joker coming back. Now following from a distance, Essa's pride for his new venture hasn't gone unnoticed by his countrymen. He's really excited about it, and, and we are excited for him. He's still asking me every day that do I do I follow how they how they do. With S's help, Jokerit's revival has been a success. And in the midst of their comeback season, the organization is resolute in continuing its illustrious legacy. Jokerit, its meaning to Finnish hockey has been great, and, and now we want to bring it back to where it was. Awesome.